another day once again and today we are going to be finishing hopefully today tonight we're going to be finishing this uh, project so we have some new coolant hoses that we decided to replace which is a good thing to do and then this big one it gets neglected it's it runs under the intake manifold and then yeah it's always a good idea to change all that and then i'm going to be putting the hoses coolant hoses back on the coolant hoses that are going to go back on there are used but they are basically brand new so i'm going to reconnect this uh banjo the the hose for the venos assembly the fan and then the intake manifold valve cover gasket and valve cover and yeah we're basically almost done guys it's been an amazing journey honestly it's it's crazy can't wait to hear like uh, you know this car running Ooh, that was a close one. Nice, that's how they go. Sweet. All right. Another important part is this cover goes on the intake cam. Just goes one of the ways, go you like that. Whoa, I really suck at it, huh? Yeah, try installing it. Maybe either this way uh, or maybe the other way. No, so put right here, just where the crack is. Yeah, a little more in the bottom. And that's it. And same on the other side. Oh yeah, it's staying down now. Nice. Good quality gasket will always stay. Really? <laughs> like you. <laughs> Are you recording me? <laughs> you, what did you say over there? <laughs> Repeat that? that, was, that was <laughs> Your back is f***ing you up and you're not even as oh. old as I am, huh? Hey, All I right. didn't say you. You got, you replaced, yeah. okay, sweet. That's yeah, replaced. that's the new one. New valve. Um. Yeah. Everything is nice cleaned and up. clean. I used the blade and I little scotch fighted it. Hell yeah. So, installing that. Sweet. Okay, we're installing the ignition coils now. Almost ready, almost ready. Gotta finish installing the fan clutch and shroud. Okay, so we're gonna be replacing now this hose. It goes to the heater core, goes to the throttle body, this big hose that gets neglected actually. And a lot of cars, if you pull an intake manifold, they never gets changed. So we're gonna do that. And then also this hose that goes to the, the heater valve, I believe, yeah. Okay, we have this hose all disconnected. I'm gonna pull it out. And there's more coolant. Okay, this new one is gonna go in. And this is the one I just pulled off. Hell yeah, you can do it, bro. I'm just wondering how I routed it. Yeah. I've got these new hoses installed here. And this one by the firewall. Ready to install this, uh, Intake manifold with brand new seals so everywhere, new, new hose. All new gaskets, all that. new hose, new this thing. Yeah. So, ready to go. We are just about done putting this machine back together. Oh, wow, I just tapped it in. Right? 
Yep. And so some of this stuff is gonna be, well, right now we just wanna start it up and see how she is. I still need to fill up the coolant. Oil, we haven't changed the oil. Uh, I'm gonna change it actually after running it for some time. Uh, it's got fresh oil, but yeah, we're gonna put the fresh coolant though right now. Yeah, everything seems to be connected so far. So we'll see. Yeah, and then we're gonna make sure that fan glitch is good and it's not hitting anything. This crank sensor wire, we have to make sure that it's not hitting that. So we'll zip tie that. I'm just gonna... Yeah, just hold it right there just in case. BMW factory point right there. Next step. Amazing Ready? bumper to fall. Yeah, slowly. Yeah. Go ahead. Nice. Amazing machine. Are you nervous? <laughs> we still gotta pull it, put the coolant in, by the way. Yeah. yeah. All right, we're good. Seriously. All right, let's do this. Start putting coolant in. Oh, I need to get some water. Okay, I'm checking oil real quick. And we need to add oil. I mean that because when we took the uh, front timing cover off, there was some oil that leaked out because the engine, the car was like tilted. So we need to add more oil too. Pour like a man. Whoa. The rear seat out? Yeah. Okay. Hold on, hold on. No, 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 no. Like that. Guys, we're about to start this amazing machine. It's been over two months, but intensive two months, I would say, of hard work. So, you know, they say hard work pays off, so. Waiting on the owner, he's grabbing the keys. We're gonna start this amazing machine after a big rebuild. All right, go ahead, cycle the key. You're in neutral, right? Okay. Cycle the keys, so turn the ignition on. Battery's dead? No. Oh, okay, cool. And then, I didn't hear the fuel pump. Did you hear the fuel pump? What the hell? Shut the key off, back on. Oh, there you go. I hear something now. Did you hear the fuel pump? Shut the blower off. Blower is off? It's the heater valve. Making the noise. Okay, cycle the key off and on multiple times. Just don't know if we're getting fuel to the rail. Huh. I'm not hearing the fuel pump right now. Maybe it's just really quiet. Okay, try cranking it. Are you sure? Yep. <laughs> woo, woo, woo. Oil pressure on, good? Oil pressure. Don't work? Okay.
leave it a little bit. I'm gonna give it a little gas, okay? Okay, so that's the first start of this machine. First start. Okay, shut it off. Sweet. All right, we don't have a lot of coolant tonight, so we're not gonna yeah. keep running it. We'll get, I'll get more for next time. But, so far so good. What does it smell like dust, right? Yeah, not seeing any leaks. It's just all that is residue. <laughs> so. It's good, good news.